Hello and welcome my beautiful Aquarius. This is your general tarot and oracle card finance and career forecast for July. Now I have to tell you shuffling these cards and these four came out and I couldn't believe it. I thought you guys have the best most positive finance and career reading of the month so and you're the last one on the list that i do i've already got pisces out there um, so let's see what this is about each week represents or each one of these rows represents a week in the month or you can take all of the energy as a collective as you see it come in okay here we go your first card is good luck your fortune is improving and you will get lucky a lucky break soon. Collect nuggets of wisdom. You will need them in the near future. So keeping your nose to the ground, doing the research, networking, getting yourself out there, being positive and realizing that because of the moves you're making, you're bringing in this luck towards you. Uh, manifesting, meditating, scripting. What are you doing, Aquarius, to draw this beautiful attention of positive energy and abundance towards yourself? This is a wonderful card of good luck. This is saying that whatever you're doing, keep doing it. Stay in alignment. Uh, you know, if you're networking, if you're out there, if you're working towards a goal, if you're taking more uh, scholastic study to add to your resume, um, whatever you're doing is going to pay off. Now you're going to have to uh, do a little moderation here. This is a balance card. This is the, uh, the, the card of, you know, taking your time. It's a card of temperance and traditional tarot, of course, and it has to do with having self-control, not overindulging anything, not rushing in, not making snap decisions or choices, um, being mindful of decisions and choices that you're making. And also cooperation is part of this card. Um, you're seeking a perfect balance right now, and often when we do that, we have to do some self-restraint, okay? Um, this is about being patient and waiting for something to come in. You may have done something here where your luck changed and you're waiting to get the full amount, the full benefits, the full rewards coming in. Have faith, okay? I love how these cards show up. Um, you know, have faith in yourself. Have faith in the system. Have faith that, you know, the powers that be, the universe, your guides, uh, you know, your, your source, um, and the powers above are helping you. Okay, so this is about waiting for something to come in. You've done something. You've had some good luck. You've either heard some good information about finances or money or your job, and you're waiting for that to happen. Maybe you've been offered a big chunk of a bonus, or maybe you've been offered a wonderful new position, a new job title. Maybe you're waiting for that to happen, and maybe you're waiting for some more money to come in as well, but have faith in it. Just be patient. Now you've got the card of magic, and it says you have the power now. Use your magic to attract what you want want into your life the sky's the limit so your luck has really changed for some of you and you're able now to have the resources to pretty much pick and choose what you want okay uh you know you haven't hit the jackpot you didn't win a lottery that's not showing up here in the reading i wish it would but it's almost going to feel like that to you because when your luck shifts that much and things are improving that much uh you can you know you have the ability to attract what you want into your life Okay, so what is it you wanted to do with your job, with your career, with your business, with your money? Um, you're going to have that ability now to use those resources to your greater benefit. You had to fight hard, though, because the seven of fire is that card of, you know, challenges and determination and and, you know, uh, advocating promoting and defending yourself about something so you you really had to work hard uh, and you may have dealt with authority figures in the process. Okay, uh, you know, struggling to get up that ladder of success, working towards those goals. Maybe some of you had to go in and have uh, lay your cards on the table and have a discussion with, you know, with your superiors there at work, uh, the powers that be, your boss, your, the CEO, the president of the company, whatever. And maybe you've had to do that uh, with authority figures. But you have apparently the power within you to do that. Okay, and to make them see your side of the story, if this is what you're doing, um, I do think that you know the you, you're going to be you're going to be getting some good luck coming your way, and possibly you're going to get what you want. Now they just said to me they may meet you halfway. Okay, uh, compromise. So they threw that word out to me right now. Thank you guys. So, um, but you're going to be happy because it'll be a lot more than what you had before. Okay, they're showing me that you could get a raise, you could get a bonus, you could get a new job description um, because you had the, 
the determination and the willpower to go in there and lay it on the table okay defending yourself saying hey this is what i have to offer this is what i can do blah 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 and you're negotiating there okay and i do think that's going to work out in your benefit because your wish comes true wow your wish is being granted but if it may not come in the way you expected no worries it's just what you need okay okay so you know this is also the card of life as well okay this is finance and you know when we this deck refers to finance and career and your, and your life in general but what you've been wanting to do as far as your career and your job goes is you know wishing for something better having something more whether it's better benefits whether it's more time off whether it's a, a raise a job description um getting that re due respect for what you put out there you're going to get the answers that you need because it says you have the answers but you're going to be doing some research figuring something out looking in the background to get answers you feel as though there's things missing okay uh at work there's some information missing you feel as though things are funny they're off uh and you're going to find out um hopefully it doesn't come in the form of gossip um but you're going to find that there will be some uh some uh secrets being revealed now you need to trust your intuition here which i think you're doing and you have that ability to do to, it's almost like a revelation surfaces for you when you get that aha moment that epiphany where you go hmm, you know what something seems weird here something seems off here at work uh something's not you know what i write you're going to do the research and find out what's going on and of course the best thing for you to do is to go in there and speak to those authority figures go to the horses you know talk to the horse's mouth basically as they say but you pretty much have the, your own answers in your head what's going on because you're so intuitive okay now the moon has to do with pisces energy you could be dealing with that particular type of an individual but i do think that you're going to find your answers will come into you but you already know them but it's almost like you needed validation you needed to hear that yeah you're right blah 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 these things are going to be happening here at work okay there could be some restructuring going on for some of you at your place of employment now you've got star power coming in at the end so you need engaging work that will let your talent shine you are a natural actor and influencer you attract fame and fortune so maybe you're in sales maybe you have that ability to sell you know teach preach and convey information to other people uh you might be coaching you know you might be some sort of a coach or a therapist uh you might be uh at the head of a team okay uh in charge in a supervisory position now and you have that ability to do that now you could be networking for something too you could be going out there and networking to attract business maybe some of you are in you know multi-level networking type of business where you need to keep building up uh, or you're just working to keep your clients happy and maybe build up more customer uh, you know numbers the lovers comes in and says you're going to be subjected to making some major decisions all right uh this is you know you may be making a major deci decision and try not to get too emotionally involved okay remember separate work from your from your emotions this is about thinking with your head today okay this month rather so if there's a subject here that you need to discuss okay get out there network find the information you need to know even though they say you have all the answers here you want to be sure and have that validated and then go in there and be able to discuss something here this is about using your head not this time because we're talking finances and your career not leading with your heart because you may be in a situation here that you have to discuss finances either with a partner at work or with your partner in life and it's very important that you're serious about it okay you need to think about that this is about making very profound and often life-changing decisions when it comes to this card all right so um you need engaging work you need something that's going to keep your creative juices flowing all right so maybe you're thinking of discussing that with your partner i'm thinking of leaving my job this you know i i feel lucky i think something's coming up i've been offered the dream job you might be doing that okay or it could be a change at work all right well I mean there's not much more to say about this reading my beautiful Aquarius because it without a doubt is an amazing positive reading so I think luck is going to be on your side I think you're going to find the answers that you need to know I think you're whatever you've been manifesting when it comes to job money and career is going to happen all right and it's all because you you demonstrated restraint uh you know t uh you know balance uh you know you stood your ground with being direct but not uh, you know not um threateningly uh you trusted your gut instincts and then when it came down to it you made the right choices 
Wow. Well, my beautiful Aquarians, ah, amazing. So I have to caption this to get your attention because you're going to want to know what's going on this month when it comes to money. I wish you a great remainder to today and a beautiful, optimistic, healthy, happy, prosperous, and successful month. And always know I send you lots of love and many blessings. And I'll see you soon, my beautiful Aquarius.